Now, Wizards Go! One night out there, everybody. This is Jordan Jones on my playthrough of New Super Mario Bros. for the Nintendo DS. If you guys give me a favor and drop a like on this video, I would really, really appreciate that. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button and click on the bell right beside me. No fight every time my new videos come out, so... Let me know down in the comments below, um... For question of the video, what is your least favorite Mario power-up? I would love to know. Like I said several times, um, if I had to pick my least favorite Mario power-up, there's multiple options I could pick. Maybe the mini mushroom, maybe. And another option would be the spring Mario suit, because that's definitely one of the worst suits I've ever seen in a Mario game. Like, the spring suit... Like, it's more of a hassle than, like, a benefit to Mario's repertoire or Mario's gameplay. Um, because the spring suit's so annoying to control. Like, it's almost impossible to control. That's how difficult it is to use. Um, it's just super difficult to use. Like, I hate spring Mario so much. That's one of my least favorites. It has to be the Spring Mario suit. And I'm kind of not too fond of the blue shell either. The blue shell's even in this game. Excuse me. <sighs> the blue shell is definitely the worst power up in, in this game. Come on. Please make it easy for me. Stop! You're making it hard. Make it simple for me. You gotta be kidding me. Wow, that was tough. I can beat the Wii version more easily than I can this version. I don't play this version as much, so I'm, I haven't practiced it as much, so I'm not as good at it as I am at the Wii version of the game. But this level is a pretty easy level. The only thing that's annoying are those enemies, because they will keep bouncing you everywhere, all the, over the place. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. I just hate desert levels. I, I'm, I'm glad to be done, almost done with World 2. I just hate desert levels. I, you know I'm not a fan of desert levels in video games, so... I just hate desert levels. My least favorite level setting in video games has to be desert levels, so... Speaking of desert levels, um... I just hate desert levels, I gotta tell you that. 2A, is there a 2B somewhere? I doubt there is. Let's do 2-6. This level's nice and chill and nice and easy. No power-up? No power-up? I need a power-up. This game's very stingy on power-ups. It does not give you a power-up when you want it. Oh. Okay, so... That's the first star coin. Easy. I just hate desert levels. I want to get down to world two. <laughs> My least favorite level setting in a video game has to be desert levels. I just hate desert. This has to be my least favorite world of the game. It has to be world two. 
Cause I am not a fan of desert levels in video games, like I've already said. Desert levels ha have the most annoying enemies ever. Like, they have the quicksand, they have the sand that's so annoying. Speaking of desert levels, I do like, what's that kingdom called in Super Mario Odyssey? Oh, the Sand Kingdom. I love the Sand Kingdom. That kingdom was awesome. Like I said, des I've never really liked desert levels. I mean, they're not terrible, but I just found them boring. Mainly, they're just boring and time-consuming. And, and they just, I just get impatient with those, because that's why I never really liked desert levels too much. Pretty good reason why I never really liked desert levels, so. There we go, we're done with World 2-6. Now all we have left is the castle, and I actually love this castle. This castle is actually really fun. Hmm. It's really easy, too, but we're not going to do the castle's secret exit yet, which that requires you beat the boss with the mini mushroom, and I hate using the mini mushroom. That will not be on video when I do that. That will be off screen. That will be off screen. No doubt. Okay, so here, this is a really easy castle, actually. It's one of the easiest, maybe the easiest castle in the game. Excuse me. That's the first dark one. Very easy. That's all you gotta do. Ow! It's okay. Excuse me. This is a really fun castle. Okay. Okay, here's what you gotta do. Not too difficult. Second star coin. Third star coin requires the mini mushroom, but the third star coin's really not that hard at all. You can do a little glitch right here to glitch through that wall right there, which is kind of cool. Alright, so, that's the third star coin. I'll try to take out the boss with the mini mushroom right now. If I can't, it'll be okay. Because this boss is a pretty easy boss, I do have to say that. So, so if you take out the boss with the mini mushroom, you'll unlock world 4. If you take it out with um, a regular power-up, you'll just unlock world 3. This boss, you just gotta ground pound him twice is all you gotta do. It's not hard. He is not hard at all. He really reminds me of Behemoth from Mario Sports Mix. And he also reminds me of Tiki Tong from... Don he also reminds me of Tiki Tong from Donkey Kong Country Returns. Um... He ain't hard. Hmm. I'm doing awfully good with him. Like I said, this is a really easy boss, like I said. All these bosses are relatively easy. I just thought I would try to beat him with a mini mushroom first. That's the only way to unlock World 4. Because if you beat World 3, you'll unlock. So, there we go. We unlocked World 4. I'm going to cut, and I will see... I, I, I'll show the cutscene into World 4 first. And then now. Now I will cut. And I will see you guys when I beat the boss of World 2. Alright guys, I am back. So you have to hit the switch right here in order to go inside these doors. Alright, so we're going to take out the boss just with regular Mario. Just with regular Fire, fly, fire Mario. Just with a regular power up. Okay, so this boss, like I said, is really easy, like I said.
with the regular Mario, we just gotta ground pound him twice. Ah, oh, I missed him. That's okay. Ah, that's fine. I don't care. He's out. And this will unlock a path to World 3. Let's save. Alright guys, that's it. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you did enjoy, don't forget to drop a like. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. And ring the bell to be notified every time I make new videos. Next time we'll be doing World 3, which will be awesome. Because you know I love water levels and video games, so... A lot more than desert levels, definitely. Alright, so... Have a wonderful day. Peace.